Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing y'all these Easy Ups, ones that I purchased at the treasure store that I made the video on. Um, just want to give y'all my first impression on the packaging. And so, my first impression was I wasn't, um, it says train underwear. And looking at the picture up here, it looked like it was going to be real underwear. So I was kind of confused. Is it a pull up or is it underwear? So it says train and underwear. And then the picture up here that says fits like underwear and protects like pampers. The way the picture looked. I look like a real pair of underwear. So it's like, this is like real underwear that's for training. Or is it going to be pull ups? Um, the picture's here. To me, the picture there look like real underwear. But it is pull ups. But. <laughs> I was a little confused by the pictures here. So I was like, the pictures do look like real underwear. Um, anyhow, you have the PJ Masks characters, the green one, the blue one, the red one. Can't tell you the names of them. My child is not a big fan of PJ Masks or hasn't become one yet. Once he changes up what he watches. Yeah. But this is this a jumbo pack. You get 25. They're the 2T to 3T. They hold 16 to 34 pounds. And they're by Pampers. Um, so I'm jump in and show y'all what they look like. They come in the red, the blue, and the green. This is the red. This is the blue. I'll see if I can pull out a green. I've already went through several of these, nearly the whole pack. That's another blue. Well, let's step into the other room and see if I can find a green. All I have is red and blue. I'm not even sure if we actually got any green in this pack. But, hey, they look to me a lot different than what the picture shows that they were supposed to look like. Okay. Show. Okay, here in the picture, it looks like actual real underwear. And then this is what you get. To me, that really looks nothing alike. The picture is kind of deceiving. What's your opinions? Um, it's just the way it's drawn, and <laughs> but it looks different than what I'm seeing when I opened up the package. Um, so it's the stretchy kind, like the parents' toys, that does not have these don't have the resealable tabs because they're made to look more like real underwear. But this is the front. And you have, well, they're both the blue character. That's the blue character, and that's the blue character. It's just the top's red, the top's blue. Um, this one says it's time to be a hero. Okay, the backs. Stretching out. Stretching out. <laughs> it looks a little more like a picture. Looks like underwear. I guess if it's stretched out, that's how it's going to look on your child. Maybe the picture is supposed to show us how it would look on your child. 
stretched out under here. Okay, so this is what it looks like straight out of the look on a child. This is a red one. I have several little clips of how it holds up to wetness. Um, a couple of nights ago, he was wearing one of these and it did leak. Um, the little boys, you have to watch, you have to make sure that you get it pulled up correctly in the front. If you don't have it pulled up, you know, their little bodies are like a fountain. The pee just comes out. And if you don't have it pulled up correctly on little boys, the pee can come out. And I think maybe that was the issue because it I forget to look that full, but there was wetness on the bed. So I think what happened was it wasn't pulled up good in his little fountain. It just went out of the full up, which would be my fault for not pulling it up far enough on him. And not really the fault of the Pampers. Other than that, they have been holding. And like I said, I'll share the clips of how they held up. And unless you do your own. Um, unless you get your own opinion of how it looks to you if they held up or not. I have showed these before. I had a box of them. Someone last year had given us a box of the Pampers Easy Up. And I haven't used them since just because they're a little couple of dollars higher than the other ones. That's mainly the reason that I haven't. But I'm putting these back into rotation. And sometimes they um, rotate try out different pull-ups and rotate back in one that I've already tried and give it a second try. So this is our second try on the Easy Up Pampers and they're holding up. Um, I paid $6.95. I thought I paid $6, but they're $6.95 time tax. Um, came to seven dollars and something or i think the lady might have said eight but after that i went into dollar general and they were twelve dollars plus tax so i still saved probably around six dollars and this was a brand new pack the pack was never open so i got it for half the price so looks like had another prize behind me. Oh, it was, um, oh, this package, I guess, I didn't see nothing wrong with the package, but I don't know. Something was wrong with the package because this had been sent over to Dirt Cheap. And Dirt Cheap was selling it for $8.99. That's nearly $9. So they only went off to $3 from the original price. But, you know, Dirt Cheap does this thing where, like, some stuff, you, um, the price they put on here isn't necessarily the actual price. But um, with this Dirt Cheap, it was originally called Treasures, and then they change the name to dark cheap treasures dark cheap shines the same thing i got it at my local store that's called treasures so they were selling it for 8.99 and then i got it for 6.95 so i saved about two dollars and some change from the price they were selling it but considering twelve dollars got it for like half the price 
can. So overall, love the packaging. Like I said, we did do these before last year, but just the fact that they're a little more expensive is why I haven't tried them again. So I'm rotating them back in. They say they don't have an allergenic, allergenic, excuse me, hypoallergenic. They are free of latex, natural rubber. And it says that you can join the Pampers Club. That's all I have. Um, I'll show y'all how they held up. Gonna um, probably go look at some Christmas trees later. We got the sweat, easy pull, easy ups, Pampers, sweat one. I have another one, but I'm not going to go digging through the trash to show it. This is another Easy Up by Pamper. Wet pull up. I'm saturated. This is the third wet pull up I've changed in the past few hours because my son keeps drinking juice. <laughs> So, this is the third one in the past Daddy, few hours, along with two, me. and he's bringing in more juice. He's been so full of juice that this is the third one in the past couple of hours, along with two messy diapers. That side holds up. Someone suggested that I show more than one, and I was doing that in previous videos, and I guess I haven't done that too much lately. I've been showing, like, maybe one diaper in the video, so I'll try to show more than one. So. Here again is how it looks, and these are the PJ Masks design. It looks like it has like a little puzzle, like, to figure out a maze. Pampers Easy Up. This is a messy diaper that y'all probably don't want to actually see. Two messy ones that you don't want to see the inside of. Someone asked how I dispose of them by just rolling them up and putting them into a bag like this. And then dumping them into. So this is the one that I showed. This was about 40 minutes ago. And now we have another wet one. This one is lesser wet because I changed quicker than I did the previous time. This is in the color red. This is the blue one. Um, so yeah, just, here's the comparison. This one's more wet. This one's lesser wet. The back of the lesser full. Now I'm going to flip this one over. Um, to the back of the more full one. This is back. Back. So there's comparison of the more full to the lesser full on the back side. And I hope you can hear me over the CB Blues Clues song. Um, people sleeping, so I'm trying to talk low, and I don't have the microphone. But there they are, I flip back over, and there's just the overall look, view of Fuller to Lesser Fool. My son will not stop drinking Capri Suns tonight. Therefore, he's in another diaper within about a 30 minute range. And this one is a little fuller than the last one. So I'm doing comparisons here. I guess about now it's not as full. It's more full. This I think that at least this was the heaviest. And then the lesser. 
Melissa on the back. The medium one, the back. And then the heavy one, that's the back of how these hold up. Excuse, blue clothes is still on in the background. But here again, you see how this one holds up. This is a fuller one. And I hope that is a good comparison to show y'all how they hold up to different levels of wetness. This is not to use in these. Not to uh, blues clues being on as I'm talking. Um, this is two that is soaked up. They're on the both of the back side. Turn around. Um, that shows you how they're holding up to the witness. Giant 